going to have the anniversary, we are going to give them gift. Nakikinig po mo ba tayo? Or if you want to, if you want to, you can bring spaghetti pa. Ano yung kasama ng mga spaghetti pa? Spaghetti pa with tomato sauce. Add spam or lunch with me so that it will be complete. Amen? And we will give them to the poor. Amen? Don't bring sardines. Don't bring noodles. Because almost every day of their lives, they are eating sardines and noodles. I tell you, bring something. Amen? Like spaghetti. Okay? Diba sa mga soft, diba sa mga mall may mga spaghetti pa? Diba sa mga department may mga spaghetti pa? Diba? Yun ang dalhin ninyo. Huwag kayo magdala ng noodles, sardinas. Nasabihin nila, purga na kami sa noodles eh. Purga na kami sa sardinas. Ito pa ibibigay mo sa amin. Break something. Amen? May tama ko ba rito? Ito. Put it in a pan. Amen? Put it in a pan. Noodles. Tomato sauce, or luncheon meat, or spam, or or anything that can be used for spaghetti. Nagigiling pa huwag kayo. If you want to, you can give hamon. Ham. Keso ni Bola and ham. I'm just kidding. But what I'm saying is true. Spaghetti noodles is, is sufficient and tomato sauce and any ingredients that will be included to cook spaghetti. Nakikinig po ko ba kayo? Eh, ano? King, magbabalat ka ng spaghetti, ha? Maroon ako bang bumili sa palike? Masama ko sa nanay mo. Nakikinig po ko ba kayo? Ipak na ho ninyo. Amen. Ipak na ninyo. Amen. Nakikinig po kayo? Tapos, mag-impita kayo ng mga mahihirap. Amen. Pagdating doon sa place na na iyon, yung mga nakapak ninyo, ibibigay natin sa mga mahihirap yan. Amen. Amen. Okay ba kayo roon? During anniversary, no, the spaghetti pack that you, that you will bring, we will give them to the poor. Amen. Kita ko pa huwag rito. Agree ba kayo roon? Huwag kayong maghihinaya na sabihin nyo, tanugod to, tanugod, saya. Huwag kayong maghihinaya at huwag din kayong maripot. Proverbs 11.24 and 25 says, Those who repress others will, will too be repressed. Those who have, those who are giving with an open hand will be blessed by God more abundantly. Proverbs 11:24 and 25. Nagikinig ko ba tayo? Amen po ba? Saan gaganapin yung ating anniversary? Sa Circle? No. Sa Quezon City Hall? No, 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 no. Sawa na tayo ron! Nakisabi, sawa na tayo ron! <laughs> Kung gusto niyo po sa Circle o sa City Hall, sige, itong kayo. Pero hindi tayo ron. Nagikinig ko ba tayo? Hindi tayo ron. May tao pa ho ba nito? Amen po ba? At gusto kong sabihin sa inyo, bago matapos ang taong ito, dito ang tingin sa magandang lalaki sa harapan, bago matapos ang taong ito, maglingkod kayo na pinakatabi sa paglingkod para sa Diyos. Listen very carefully. Whatever the true prophet prophesied in the name of the Lord shall come to pass. What are the signs of true promise of God? Whatever He says in the name of the Lord shall come to pass. I tell you, this is the time of blessings and promotions. I tell you. Yes. Nagigilig po ho ba tayo? Even those who are affected by Super Typhoon Yolanda, if they will only cry out to God, then the Lord will help them and bless them abundantly. Nagiginig po ba tayo? Kamusapin mo na ang iyong mga mahal sa buhay. Sabihin mo sa kanila sa iyong mga mahal sa buhay na nasa Pilipinas at nasa ibang bansa. Sabihin mo sa kanila, magkaloon tayo sa kiyo-kiyo. At maglingkod na tayo ngayon sa Panginoon. Sa mga sinabi ng totoong lingkod ng Diyos, sinabi ng totoong propeta ng ignan ng Panginoon, na anuman ang ating 
Biblia verse na ibibigay ka gawin sa ng Panginoon ay tatapatan ng Diyos ng sobra-sobra. Amen! You know, we cannot outgive God. We can never outgive God. We cannot outgive our God. Given shall be given to you. Good measure, press down, second together, and running over. Nakikinig pa ho ba tayo? Kaya ngayon pa lang, kung dala mo na, ibigin mo na. At kung hindi mo dala, dali mo sa mga susunod. O kaya, kausapin mo yung mga kapatid dati niya, kung yung bank account ng ministry, ipasok mo, itabi mo lang yung, 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 yung deposit slip. Nakikinig pa ho ba tayo? At saka yung ginagawa ng ating mga kapatid na mula sa Amerika, mula sa Canada, ako sabi may mga yun natin, mula sa Japan, pwede siya na mag-Skype habang nag-Bibrit sa Corito. Online streaming. Nakikinig pa ko ba tayo? Hindi biro-biro na ako'y nag-English. Just for the sake that I want to speak English. No? Because right now they are listening in other parts of the world through online streaming. Tell your uh, loved ones abroad. Tell your friends abroad. They can hear press message from above. Amen? Through online streaming. Amen? Nakikinig pa ho ba kayo? Purihin ang pangalan ng ating pagnumis sa buhay. Walang pangalan natin ang Panginoon. Hallelujah! Kaya, bago tayo magbukas, anong number na natin? Nasa na tayo? Number 3. Uh, number 3. Number 3 na ba tayo? Number three, the Lord will be our judge in the end. Matthew 71, but after 23. Matthew 71, 721 to 23 says, Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does the will of my Father who is in heaven. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does the will of my Father who is in heaven. Who will enter the kingdom of heaven? Not everyone who says to Jesus, Lord, Lord. But only the one who does the will of the Father who is in heaven. Many will say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in your name? And in your name drive out demons? And in your name perform many miracles? Lord, kami po ni Sintana ng ibang wika. Nagpagay siya ng mga demonyo. Gumawa kami ng mga himala. Then I will tell them plainly, I never knew you. Away from me, you, evildoers. Nakikinig pa ho ba tayo? Um, the Lord will be our judge. In the end, many will say, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in your name and in your name drive out demons and in your name perform many, many miracles? Then I will tell them plainly, plainly, I never knew you away from me, you evildoers. Nakikinig pa ho ba tayo? So, ibig sabihin, sa bandang huli, ang Diyos ay maghuhuko. Sasabihin ng Panginoon, lumayo kayo sa akin. Away from me, you evildoers. Away from me, lumayo kayo sa akin, mga mapagawa ng kasalanan. Only the one who does the will of the Father in heaven will be saved, will go to heaven. Nakikinig po ako ba tayo? Amen. Next. Repent now from our sins before it's too late. We must repent now from our sins before it's too late. Super Typhoon Hayan, international name of Yolanda. Super Typhoon Yolanda. Last November 2013, we know that many died, right? Many died. They were caught unaware. And not only that, what did happen to their houses was out. Sabi nga, di ba, natarating natin was out. Nakikinig pa ho ba tayo? The number of, uh, of casualties are getting higher and higher because many dead bodies are being discovered continually in the Tagloban and other parts of Visaya. Many died 
because of super typhoon Hayat, you not like the Philippines. So before it's too late, before death comes to us, before poverty comes to us, we must repent now from our sins, right? The Bible says in 1 Timothy chapter 6 verse 7, 1 Timothy chapter 6 verse 7, For we brought nothing into the world, and we can take nothing out of it. What a nice words. For we brought nothing into the world, and we can take nothing out of it. We were born naked. We have no earrings and we were born. No bracelets. Nothing. And the Bible says, we brought nothing to the world and we can take nothing out of it. Kaya habang may buhay, ngayon na maglikod. At habang may buhay, ngayon na magkaloob. Amen? Habang may buhay, ipagamit na ang talento sa Diyos. Mahirap po ang mga tumataka sa Diyos. Sapagkat hindi gumaganda ang buhay pati ang kanilang pamilya. At ang masaklap kapag ang buhay ko'y kinuha ninyo. Do not escape. Do not run away from the Lord. Your life will become miserable if you will run away from the Lord. Serve the Lord now and serve the Lord with gladness. Everything in this present world are all owned by God. Lahat ng pag-aari natin ay pag-aari ng Diyos yan. Amen. We are all God's stewards. We are God's managers. We are not the owners. We are God's managers, God's stewards. So if the Lord needs it, so we must offer it to God. Amen. Even our own very life is owned by God. So we must use our life for God's glory. Nakikinig ko po ba tayo? Pakinig kayo sa akin. Ang tunay na kristalismo, hindi tumagalo. Ang tunay na kristalismo, yung naglilingkot. Ang tunay na kristalismo, yung nagkakalao. Ang tunay na kristalismo, yung talento mo, pinapagamit mo sa Diyos. Yung tunay na kristalismo, naglilingkot siya ng parami, kaya naman natin sa true Christianity. True Christianity is not just listening and listening and listening and listening. True Christianity offer your talent to God. True Christianity brings souls to God. Amen? True Christianity is serving the Lord. Amen? Serving the Lord with gladness. And that is true Christianity. Christians are followers of Christ. If Christ, when He became man here on earth, He offered His life to God the Father, so we must also offer our lives to God. Nagiginig po ba tayo? Kaya itong anibersaryo ito, huwag mo sabihin, wala kang panahon para mag-practice. Gagabihin kami, gagabihin kami. Huwag mo sabihin yun. I-offer mo yung buhay mo sa Panginoon. I-alay mo yung buhay mo sa Panginoon. Huwag ang puripot. Wala kang magbili ng nite, wala kang magbayad ng nite, ay nang nilipor, mahal ang pagpatahe. Huwag ka lang puripot. Lahat na sa sakit. You know, I will allow my Mercedes Benz to be used during anniversary. I will allow my purse, my Jaguar, to be used to pick up attendees. Yes, from their respective places. All my cars, expensive cars, will be used to pick up attendees. Amen. And even I myself will give large amount of money. I tell you. Nagkinig pa ba ba kayo? Yes! I will give millions of money. Not just hundred thousands of money, but millions. Amen! Hello! Don't be kulipot! Ito ang pahuman nito. Pagdating ng offering time, dinudukot-dukot yung mibutas eh. Tinaan yung pita. Hindi gano'n ang pagkakaloob. Nakikinig mo ba tayo? Pag yung asawa mo, humahala sa pagkakalaw mo, yung asawa mo, ilagay mo sa operate, magulong ka ha. 
<laughs> Allow not anybody to hinder you in giving your best to God. Allow not anybody in in your service to God. Nakikinig pa po ba tayo? We must accept Jesus Christ as our Lord God and Savior now. And we must serve the Lord God now. You know, how many thousands died in Tacloban, in Leyre, in Cebu, in other parts of Visaya? Thousands died. They were caught and away. Before that comes to us, we must serve the Lord now. Amen? Nakikinig po ba tayo? Eh, ang dapat ang magagawa mo sa mga kasintahan, kung pumalik ka sa ministry, ayaw ka magkaroon ng kasintahan na wala sa ministry. Nabihin mo. Saan tayo, saan tayo, saan tayo matatagpuan? Sa ministry. <laughs> Kita ang pahubo dito. It's one of us. God gave us a role to fulfill. It's one of us. Nakikinig pahubo tayo. Bawat isa sa atin ay binigyan ng role. Amen? So next, next. Isaiah 55 verse 6 to 7. Seek the Lord while He may be found. Call on Him while He is near. Seek the Lord while He may be found. Call on Him while He is near. Let the wicked forsake their ways and the unrighteous their thoughts. Let them, them turn to the Lord and He will have mercy on them. And to our God, for He will freely pardon. Again, seek the Lord while He may be found. Call on Him while He is near. Let the wicked forsake their ways and the unrighteous their thoughts. Let them turn to the Lord and He will have mercy on them and to our God for He will bring me for that. Hanapin daw natin ang Diyos habang natin siya. Tawagan natin ang Diyos habang palapit siya. Takloba, Leyde, Samar, Cebu, Akla, Kapis, and, and other parts of Isaiah, many died because of super typhoon Hayan. They were caught unaway. I do not know. Hindi ko alam kung nasaan ang kanilang mga kaluluwa kayo. I do not know if their souls are in heaven or in hell. Only God knows. If they repented from their sins before they died, then they are in heaven right now. But if not, they are in hell right now. So the Bible says in Isaiah 55 verse 6, Before your death comes, before any tragedy comes, seek the Lord while He may be found. Call on Him while He is still. Let the wicked forsake their ways and the unrighteous their thoughts. Let them turn, turn to the Lord and He will have mercy on them and to our God for He will freely pardon. Next. Next. Conclusion. Truly, tragedy comes. Sometimes tragedy cannot be avoided. Sometimes tragedy cannot be avoided. And hindi wala naman ako na ang Pilipinas ay naghanda sa super typhoon Yolanda. And hindi wala naman ako ang kabisayaan ay naghanda sa super typhoon Yolanda. Kaya lang hindi nila inaasahan na ganong katindi ang tragedy. Naniniwala ba tayo? Kaya anong nangyari na was out? at maraming namatay. You know, truly tragedy cannot be avoided. And sometimes, we are caught unaware because the tragedy that are coming to us are great. Like what 
happen to Visayan region, Visayan provinces. They said, the government said, we are prepared for the coming of the Super Typhoon Ayan. You're not there in the Philippines. What? We didn't expect that uh, the damage will be great. We didn't expect for it. Oh, you see, nagiginig po po ba tayo? Minsan ganyan tayo, di ba? Amen po ba? Eh, minsan may kakalapit na lang sa'yo eh. May natawag na lang sa'yo eh. Patay na sa ganito. Patay? Hindi, hindi totoo yun. Nagbibiru ka lang. Nabuka lang yun. Pero minsan totoo ka lang eh. Nagiginig po po ba tayo? Huwag kang mabibigla, huwag kang mabibigla. Ano huwag kang mabibigla? Biglang-bigla na nga eh. Patay na sa ganito. May you see? Nagiginig po po ba tayo? Sometimes death comes to us unexpectedly. Sometimes death comes in an, 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 an unexpected ways. So we must be prepared always. In ulit ko, I'm almost done. Ang kamatayan ay dumarating na hindi mo alam at hindi mo namamalayan. So we must be ready and we must be prepared. Amen? Truly, tragedy comes, but if we are with Jesus, truly tragedy, even great tragedy comes, but if we are with Jesus, He will protect and rescue us. Truly tragedy, even great tragedy comes, but if we are with Jesus, He will protect and rescue us. And if, it's, if it is truly our time to die or time to face the Lord now, He will give us eternal life. You know, I am, not, I am not afraid to die because I know where I am going to. I know I will be in heaven. I will only I will, I, I will uh, only be afraid to die if I will go to hell. Nakikinig pa po ba tayo? Tanongin mga katabi mo, ako ka mamamatay. Saan ka pupunta pag namatay ka? Hello. Sino rin kayo nangalit na ang buhay? Sino? Yung misan, 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 muntik-muntik ka na kayo mamatay. Ako dalawang beses na akong muntik na mamatay eh. I almost died twice. Yes. Yes, this is true. I'm not kidding. Because I was drawn thrice, twice. I was drawn twice. I did not know how to swim. I drove twice. I almost died twice. But God saved me because He has a purpose for my life. May tao pa ho ba dito? Ngayon, pangatlo! Pagdalunod pa uli ako, patay na ako. Ang katatlo lang yun eh. Kaya ayaw ang lumangay sa madalim eh. Doon na ako sa mababaw tripid. Pero sira ng tripid na lulod pa rin eh. Yan ang malungkot. <laughs> Death comes to us unexpectedly, right? And we must be prepared. Amen? Call on the Lord while He may be found. Call on the Lord while He is near. Call on the Lord while He may be found. And he wipe away your tears. Call on the Lord while he may be found. Call on the Lord while he is near. Call on the Lord while he may be found. And he wipe away your tears. Fear of death. Amen. Fear of tragedy. Fear, 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 fear. F E A R. Nakikinig po po ba tayo? Ay, stand, please stand. There be. Standing please. Hallelujah. O bago maging huli ang lahat, magsisina tayo ng kasanat pag ulit loob na tayo sa Diyos. 
before it's too late. Do not hide our sins. Do not cover our sins. Let us admit that we are sinners. Ask God's mercy. Ask God's forgiveness. Be safe and restored. Be revived. Hallelujah. We must not boast what we did and what we are doing but to, or what we are right now. Because only those who are commending by God, the end day will be justified. Habang tayo ang lahat ay nakayong at nakapikit, while we are standing, bowing our hands, and eyes closed, let us examine our hearts. Are we willing to admit that we are sinners? Are we willing to forsake all our sins and iniquities? Are we willing to reform our bad ways? Are we willing to ask God's forgiveness and ask God's mercy? And the Bible says, if we are saying that we don't have sins, we are big liars. But the Bible says in 1 John 1, 9, if we will confess our sins to the Lord, He is faithful and just to forgive us and cleanse us from all of our unrighteousness. Sa oras na ito, suriin natin ang ating mga sarili. Suriin natin ang ating mga puso. Huwag natin pagtakpan. Huwag tayong magturon at huwag tayong magsisihan. Kung titingnan natin ang ating mga sarili, kung tayo ay tama sa harapan ng Panginoon. Check our hearts! If we are living right in the front of the eyes of God. Hallelujah. There is no glory in my own wisdom. There is no might. There is no might. 